A special thank you to each of our subscribers who make this channel possible. Here's today's story. The NFL set a new record last week with the most watched week, one of the regular season in league history. According to Joe Reedy of the Associated Press, the NFL's Week 1 games were watched by an average of 21 million viewers per game, which was the highest viewership ever for a Week 1 slate. The NFL and Nielsen announced that their combined television and digital ratings for Week 1 were up 12% from last year. They also noted that 123 million people watched at least part of one game, which was the most for a Week 1 schedule since 2019. The NFL averaged 21.0 million viewers per game during the league's opening week, making it the most watched week one on record. The league and Nielsen said Wednesday morning that the per game average on TV and digital platforms was a 12% increase over last year. All told, 123 million people saw at least part of one game, its highest total for an opening week since 2019. NBC had the most watched game with the defending Super Bowl champion Chiefs' 27-20 victory over the Ravens in Thursday's opener averaging 29.2 million on TV and digital. It was NBC's second-largest regular season game since 2006, when it acquired the Sunday Night Football Package. The Sunday night game between the Lions and the Rams, which Detroit won 26-20 in overtime, averaged 22.7 million, a 3% jump from last year. Tom Brady's first game as Fox's top analyst, the Cowboys' 33-17 win over the Browns, averaged 23.93 million. The six games that were part of Fox's doubleheader, four early, two late, averaged 18.64 million, making it the network's best start since 2020. This was the first time since 2020 that Fox solely had the Sunday afternoon doubleheader in Week 1. Both CBS and Fox carried two games apiece on the opening Sunday the past three seasons. CBS averaged 17.79 million for its six games, its most watched week one single header since it reacquired NFL rights in 1998. Most of CBS affiliates had games in the 1 p.m. Eastern Time window, but New York, Chicago, Atlanta and Pittsburgh got Jim Harbaugh's first game as coach of the Chargers against the Raiders at 4.05 p.m. New York, Chicago, Atlanta and Pittsburgh could not air games in CBS early window because it is a league rule that no game is shown opposite the game of the local team. The Eagles' 34-29 victory over the Packers in the NFL's first Friday night week one game in 54 years averaged 14.0 million on Peacock and NBC affiliates in Philadelphia, Green Bay, and Milwaukee. It was the second most watched live event in Peacock's four-year history, behind last season's AFC wildcard game between Kansas City and Miami. Monday Night Football on ABC, ESPN, ESPN2 and ESPN Plus averaged 20.4 million for the 49ers' 32-19 win over the Jets despite most DirecTV customers not being able to receive it due to its carriage dispute with Disney. The only way they could watch it is if their ABC affiliate was not owned by Disney, which was not the case for DirecTV customers in New York and San Francisco. The average was down from the 22.7 million for last year's opener between the Jets and Buffalo. That's all for this story. We upload videos every day covering many different subjects, so hit that subscribe button to stay informed. Thanks for watching.